Hello, this is Dave Brixis with Explosive Sports Performance, EXSP.biz, back with another video blog that we're going to be talking about here. And this is one of my rants that I usually try to get on um, every once in a while, and it's training the correct way. All right? A lot of people out there get bought, bought, bought into the hype of a lot of these gyms out there, such as your, LA, you know, your big chain gyms um, that go out there and promote, hey, we do all this kind of stuff. And that's fine. Some of those gyms are definitely great for certain things, maybe not other things. But if you're looking to become a great athlete, then you better train like an athlete trains. And it's not just going on a machine and doing that kind of work. It's not just grabbing big um, atlas stones and pressing logs over your head and stuff like that. They're not all that things that you always need. You need a comprehensive plan to make yourself the best athlete possible. You've got to find out where you're deficient what you need to work on to make yourself great for the sport that you play or sports that you play and then understand why you do those things. Don't buy into the hype, well this is the hype thing right now. I mean when I was growing up I could talk about a couple of different programs that were out there that they were the hype. I mean they've since faded which most of these hype programs of today, and I know a lot of people out there know them especially if you train athletes you're probably not the biggest fan of a lot of them because they're just out there trying to push this and trying to push kids into the ground and not really give them a progression of how to get better. They're just trying to beat you up, beat you up, beat you up, beat you up. And they're not giving you a way of actually, why am I taking this step here? Why am I taking this step here, this step here? To make yourself great. All right? So you want to make sure that you find a program that's actually going to be utilized to what you really need. Now, if you want to be a bodybuilder, fantastic. Get a program that's designed by a bodybuilder or somebody at least has the knowledge in the bodybuilding realm. Okay? Don't just go to um, the sports performance guy who has no idea how to bodybuild somebody and just because, well, he has these great athletes here, that all of a sudden you're going to learn something. And vice versa. Okay? If you want to be a great athlete, don't just go to a bodybuilder who's never really trained an athlete to get better. You need to know what you're getting. Okay? You need to know why you're doing it and what you're doing for. And I'm really going to stress the athlete part because training an athlete is different. All right. Yeah, the basics are still there of how to get a person into a certain position, but you've got to know why you're getting them into this position and what's the purpose of these positions. It's not just, I want to put on all this weight on the person, but then they can't move. They're inflexible. Okay, they can't move. They can't run. That's not athletics. Okay, that's not being an athlete. You've got to be able to move. Number one, at least in my opinion, is you've got to have explosion. All these sports require explosion. Even golf. When you swing that club through, you've got to be explosive. Tennis you got to have explosion. They all require some type of explosion. With a lot of these programs out there, when you sit on a machine, they're not explosive. I mean, let's be honest. You sit in a machine, you push it out, you isolate a muscle, great. But the body doesn't move in isolation. It's your body, the body moves in movements. So when you find a person, find a person that's actually going to train your movement, not the muscle. That's where the difference is. If you want to be a bodybuilder, you want to have the biggest biceps, and you want to have the chest, and you want to be all ripped up, awesome. Nothing wrong with that. I have no problem with that. Okay, I think that's great. But if you want to be an athlete, make sure you're training the correct way to train to be an athlete, to be a great athlete. All right, you want to know what you're getting, what the sports require. Okay, explosion, in my opinion, is number one. You better have speed and acceleration, deceleration, change of direction in there. All right, strength, strength is the basis of everything you need. And then size. Okay, you got to put the whole gamut in there. Flexibility is definitely a huge issue. Okay, because if you're inflexible, even though you can run a 40 and 4-2, but you're never on the field because you always pull your hamstring, you're no good. So you need to have a comprehensive program of what you're looking for. What are you trying to get out of it? Just because you're the biggest guy in the world does not mean you're a great athlete. Okay, let's get that straight. Just because you're the biggest man, the strongest man in the world, doesn't mean you're a great athlete. Okay? You got to be able to put everything together. You got to know why you're training, what you're getting out of it what you're going to utilize it for, and how to move on from there, how to progress yourself safely, but effectively and efficiently, all right, to continue to improve and not get stale. All right, if you do come up with a nick or an injury from a practice, how are you going to get out of that? Does your trainer or the person who's working with you know? A lot of them don't. A lot of them don't know that a lot of back pain in athletes isn't really caused from the back. It's caused from, caused from the tight hamstrings, tight glutes, I'm finding more and more tight glutes, and that's a whole different video that I could go on, a whole other blog that I can talk about, is glute weakness and glute tightness, and tight hips. And that causes a lot of problems with low back. We start working with those things with, these, with our athletes 
A lot of them come back to me in, in a couple of days, I don't have any more back pain. Had nothing to do with their back. It wasn't like they hurt their back. It had to do with a lot of the inflexibility that they're created from doing things incorrectly or specializing in one sport where they're only utilizing this sort of muscle this way and they're not getting the most out of it. So if you're out there and you're looking for a training firm, don't just go to the hype, as I call it, the hype gyms. Okay, because this is the cool thing that's in. Go to some place that you're going to get the most out of it. All right, that you're going to learn safely. I could, I could teach anybody how to do a power clean, be honest with you, and I could show them in a day or two. And guarantee I'll be wrong. When I learned, I learned from one of the best, all right, who went through the USA weightlifting and all that kind of stuff. He taught me how to break it down specifically of how to do the power clean, hand clean, snatch correctly. It took me probably two months to learn those things properly and feel comfortable doing them. Yet some of these people go in there in two classes and think they know how to power clean or think they know how to snatch. I, that's not going to happen. All right? You need to know how to do these compound movements, but let's do them safely. All right? Don't just buy into the hype of, well, this is what everybody's doing. Look at this. This is the cool thing out there. The cool is not always the right way to go. All right? You want to make sure you get the program you need to make yourself the best athlete out there or the best person out there. Make sure you do it. Make sure you find the person who's going to get you there safely and effectively. This is Dave Brixis. Make sure you get out there and unleash your potential. Also, make sure you go to our website, exsp.biz. All our programs are on there. Plus, we got a great online training program that you guys can look up. It's Unleash Performance. You can get on there if you're far away from the central PA area. You guys can get on there, follow us. We can design programs for you. You guys can get out and do them, and we can progress you safely and effectively with all our videos and stuff online. All right, look forward to it. Comment below, do whatever you have to do, but continue to follow us also on Facebook as I continue to post a lot of stuff up there, pictures of our athletes who have accomplished something, who have done great things, and also different questions I ask. I'd like to have your input as well. All right, look us up on YouTube as well. We have tons of videos there, um, Explosive Sports Performance, and look forward to it. You guys have a great week. Unleash that performance.